When an eclectic group of individuals gets trapped in an elevator, personalities clash, and laughter ensues as they navigate the awkward and unexpected situation. This is Dave, a jolly man with a love for dad jokes and a penchant for getting into awkward situations. This is Maria, a no-nonsense businesswoman with a razor-sharp wit and a sarcastic streak. This is Raj, an arrogant startup tech with who somehow manages to be both charming and insufferable. This is Lila, a sophisticated art dealer with a taste for the finer things in life and little patience for incompetence. This is Hero, a laid-back skater boy with an adventurous spirit and a knack for finding trouble. This is Emma, a fitness-obsessed mom who balances a compassionate heart with a competitive edge. Well, this is an uplift. <laughs> I'd ask you to stick to their job jokes, but I fear you might elevate those too. <laughs> if this is your way of networking, Dave, it's pretty elevated. <laughs> Can we all raise the bar a bit? <laughs> Who knew an elevator could be such a great place to lift your spirits? As long as it doesn't interfere with my workout schedule. <laughs> so, what do you call a lift full of people in a modern building? Contemporary art. <laughs> and here I thought we were trapped in an elevator, not a bad comedy club. <laughs> That's one way to work your core, trying not to laugh at these jokes. Well, at least I have my board. Anyone up for some stationary tricks? <laughs> I'll pass. Unlike our elevator, I prefer things that actually work. <laughs> Shouldn't we be trying to call for help instead of making light of the situation? <laughs> Good point, Lila. Let me give it a shot. And when that fails, we'll have Dave's jokes to keep us warm. <laughs> no signal here. Anybody want to pass the time with some two truths and a lie? Sure. I need something to distract me from Raja's ego. <laughs> hey, my ego is deserved. I've only crashed one tech startup this month. <laughs> I once sold a fake painting for a million, I hate modern art, and I love cats. Let me guess, you actually love dogs. <laughs> My turn. I've run 10 marathons, I'm afraid of treadmills, and I once punched a guy in a spin class. No way anyone that loves fitness is afraid of treadmills. <laughs> I've negotiated multi-million deals, I'm fluent in five languages, and I enjoy camping. I feel like camping is the lie, because who actually enjoys sleeping on the ground? <laughs> okay, my go. I've hacked a government website, I own 20 computers, and I can't swim. It's definitely swimming. You tech types prefer surfing the web. <laughs>